Ruski Head here with yet another lesson. This one is about the beginning of the school year. We'll get to the beginning of this lesson shortly, following the intro song. But in the meantime, be sure to study the vocabulary words for this lesson. If you're stressed from too much study, or if you're feeling blue, Ruski Head is always ready with a funny joke or two. When it comes to summer, Visio Horashia Kanshaetsia, or Visio Horashia Zakanshavaetsia, both of which mean all good things must come to an end. On the other hand, Minogia Raditili Satnetur Penium Ajidayot Pervava Dinya Uchobi, which means many parents eagerly anticipate the first day of school. It should be noted that Uchoba means studies or learning. However, not everyone feels the same way about the beginning of the school year. Nikaturaya dieti bayatsia pervava dinya uchebi, which means some children dread the first day of school. Nikaturaya dieti nerv nichayut pervi uchebni dien, which means some children are nervous on the first day of school. And. De la drugi dieti nachala u chevnava koda eta pova dla praznika. Which means for other children, the beginning of the school year is cause for celebration. Back to school sales are normally held before the beginning of the school year, and lots of money gets spent as a result. Back to school sales translates to shkolnaya yarmarka in Russian and shkolnaya yarmarka. Literally means something like school fair. Obviously, the main items other than back to school clothing sold at back to school sales are school supplies, and that translates to Shkolnaya pri nalezhnosti in Russian. Some of the items sold at back to school sales events include Milimetrovkaya bumaga, or simply Milimetrovka, which means graph paper, Paka registratar, which means binder or folder. Lastik or Stjorka, which means eraser, and other things such as pens and pencils and rulers. Speaking of rulers, here's a quick joke. What is the king of all school supplies? I don't know. What? The ruler. A literal translation of this joke goes like this. Keto yavlayatsya karolyom vesye shkolni pri nadlejnasye. Yaniznayo i keto pravitel ili lineka. As you might expect, the pun is ruined since ruler translates to two different words in Russian. If we're talking about a person ruling over a nation, then the word is pravitel. And if we're talking about a measuring stick, then the word is lineka. Another quick joke goes like this. Dai ruchku, which means give me a pen. Pravuyu ili levuyu, which means right or left. The joke being the implication that there are separate pens to use in the right or the left hand. The vocabulary words for this lesson are as follows. Yarmarka means fair. Bumaga means paper. Lastik means eraser. Neterpenia means impatience. Ajidats means to expect. Uchoba means learning. Boyatsya means to fear. Nervnichats means to be nervous. Povad means cause. Praznik means celebration. Karol means king. And Pravitel means ruler. And that's it for this lesson. Ruski Ed, signing out now. Das Vidanya!